This is KOAM News at 9 on Fox 14. I'm Tanya Bach. A number of businesses in Pittsburgh's Block 22 say construction work to fix one of the recently renovated buildings is understandable, but it's bringing unwanted pressures for their customers. KOAM's Lonnie Walton explains. Heather Horton owns Toast, a restaurant currently surrounded by construction, scuffling in Pittsburgh's Block 22 development. And she's not alone. Melissa Lewis runs a home decor next door. Um, it's just the bad timing. That's the, the main thing. Um, this fall, fall is always very highly, you know, busy. If we're seeing a reduction in the time that's supposed to be our busiest time of year, that can make or break a business. The building's owners, however, are concerned about something else breaking. Yeah, President of Public so Affairs and Engagement here. Molly Bumgarner says while they want to be supportive, the construction is crucial due to falling cement that is already posing a danger to the community. The decorative cement from the top of the building, as well as some of, um, you know, what was there between the bricks was starting to pop out. While Horton and Lewis say they've noticed the problem, it's still an inconvenience. I mean, I think the idea is to secure the building, make sure it's safe, make sure that it's going to be good for the next hundred years, you know, so I, I believe in that. Horton may have to add a slice of patience to her menu. As Bumgarner says, construction is suspected to continue into October. Reporting in Pittsburgh, I'm Lonnie Walton, KOAM News. Baumgartner says just under 100 students live in the student housing apartments above the businesses at Block 22.